that battle right there actually made me start watching battles. And I, you know, that, that, that ain't my thing, you know what I'm saying? I, I don't really have any time to be watching that shit, but I saw that. I don't know who put me on to that shit. Somebody did. Actually, Lux was telling me. He was like, yo, he was telling me to come to the battle, you know what I'm saying? But I was, I'd be in the street running around all crazy. So when the shit was over and, and, and the shit was online and I watched the shit, I was watching it on we actually I was you know in the street running around and my man showed me a little bit of it on his phone. So I'm like, oh shit. He's on the phone like, yo beloved, you gotta be there, beloved. I'm going it's gonna be monumental, I'm telling you. I don't wanna tell you, I wanna tell you, but I can't tell you what I wanna tell. I'm like, what? And then um I'm 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 doing a hot 97 Harlem Day Festival, rocking on stage and my phone is going off. And I look and somebody texts me like Hurry up and get down. <laughs> I said, what happened? He said, the man pulled up in a hearse. And I said, who? He said, Lux. I said, oh my God. And that's why I got a headache right now. Yo, Loaded Lux's rounds gave me a headache. They gave me a fucking headache. But at the same time, it was crazy. It was crazy. Lux is an alien. Like, you know what I mean? That nigga is a real... He's a Martian. He's not on some G shit. The fuck, like, words, what words he say, like, the, the patterns he use, that's just genius shit. You know what I mean? That's genius shit. Let's start again at the very beginning. Well, Calico, we got you on the Battle Rap Arena, and, and you know, we, we make every rapper do it when they come through. Call mm -hmm. somebody out, per curse them out, man. Air somebody out, come on. That's it's it's going to all, make. the only person I'm calling out right now is going to always be the same. It's going to be Lux. He, he's the only person that is really irking my nerves right now. Like, nobody else is really getting on my nerves. Like, Lux is really pissing me off. See, this is a storyline. You gotta understand something. Calico called me out at uh, the previous Summer Madness. Mm. I just came to enjoy, you know I me, mean, the show mm. as a fan. And the man called me out. I thought it was a friendly gesture for real, for real. I mean, but at the same time, though, you know, and knowing I was going to make my return, this was perfect. I've been getting money since a young nigga. But now that I'm a brown dog girl. Since a little nigga, nigga still thinking I'm a little nigga. Cause I've been on the low, low, low. I gotta let him know, know, know. I'ma get him. Hey Sharia, I'm alright, I'm fine. Yeah, I'm trying to ship a body from New York to Detroit. Yes, I'm from the funeral home. No, he's not a, not from the military. Not at all. Definitely not a soldier. So I can't ship human remains to, to Detroit airport? That is, that is true. Now when you mean human remains, you mean like like the body broke up or you mean just in one piece or what do you mean? No. The ashes. The ashes. Ah so I can't send the body there, but I can send the ashes. Yeah. 
All right, so walk me through the ashes process then. I'll I, I do it that way then. All right, um, is it is it, is it a particular date that I want to um, do it? Can I reserve it for that date? No, you can ship it any time. That's, that's not that thing. You can ship it within 10 days. All right, so I, I'll do the ashes then. Okay. So, no, I don't. But you left for the funeral, right? Yeah, I'm a funeral home. I'm trying to ship it out August 19th. They need to wait. Alright, thank you. So you've been very helpful. Uh, I can't. Detroit don't take you in the remain. I'll sit here. I'm gonna take the ashes. You know what? You're gonna die here, so fuck it. We're gonna bury you here. We go to the cemetery. Let's, let's go to the cemetery. Let's find out what the situation is. Get him right. Cemetery floor. Let's ride out. Return of the legends. See young blood and way over his head. You understand what I'm saying? Uh, he ain't mean for this to happen. It sounded slick at the time. You know what I mean? But he ain't mean for this to happen. See, it's a difference between when you dead serious about what you're doing and you just want to get seen. You understand what I'm saying? See, I'm, I'm gonna go in there and, 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 and work. I'm not gonna play with you. You know what I mean? I'm gonna treat you like the rest of these crash dummies that are ran in the hills. You feel me? They ain't want that work, but you about to see why they ain't want that work. The return of loaded Like, yo, what is this doing here? Then I saw the obituary. And I was like, what is this doing here? Then I saw a homie with the mask and the shovel. And I was like, what is he doing here? Then when the nigga came on stage, nigga came on stage with the suit. Now, I was supposed to carry the casket up here. This work mm -hmm. was my son. You know what I'm saying? I had my lion thing shook me off, battle rapping and all that. But the last minute, I said, nah, I'm not gonna go on that stage. I ain't even tell Lux my reason why. He about to find out right now why. The only reason I ain't get on that stage at Summer Madness 2 was because I felt if I stood on that stage, Calico gonna point his finger at me and say a couple lines towards me and make himself look even better than what he is. Is y'all ready? Round one, loaded blocks. Welcome back, my nigga. Welcome back, my nigga. Let's get it. Let's get it. It's on you. Smack, is you ready? Cow, is you ready? On that jack mat. First smack back, we got a nigga to back smack. We gonna rock. It's gonna be a lot of head rolls. Breath holes at the depth toe, you know, you Detroit niggas came to get beat. Rock. But y'all gonna always come together at funerals. You've even now decided. But why is this done every time that the preacher signs in? Well, it's a sign. Look at all these portraits of my corpses. I'm just waiting on you nigga sizes. I can have the pain in your big pain into a twit frame, get Eminem the eight mile by tenant, or worse the five nine. So that right there was a triple entendre right there. So what he's doing first of all, he's talking about Eminem eight mile, worse the five nine. That's one meaning. Then he's saying I can have Eminem eight by tenant. So he's talking about, I can have Eminem take your coffin or take your portrait and make an eight by 10 of it. And then he's saying, or I can have Royce 590. 
So you're talking about Royce 5'9", or you can get Royce to 5'9", to 5x9 your portrait, or 5x9 your coffin. So that was crazy right there. We got all night. We can get Eminem to 8 mile box in it, or Royce to 5'9". Though hip hop don't need any more these niggas dying behind it. You keep trying, but all you niggas is good for is deep frying. They told your daddy in him a great gene was hiding. Well, he should have kept it in his jeans. Your life would have had a better fight on a bare sheet drying. Rather than... Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me just say this. Save it for the end. Let me work. Please, let me work. When they break down every round that I've sketched bouts, there's nothing tougher than smooth as the rusty tools in the shed house. You niggas came here playing. It's cool. But y'all gonna leave giving head counts. They didn't even book you niggas rooms. I told them Harlem Hospital giving beds out. I'm not gonna lie to you, man. Like, even when he stopped, and he couldn't get it back, I'm gonna be like, I didn't even matter. Yeah. And that's the messed up thing. I mean, after Crazy. the first round, I thought the shit was gonna be. I thought over. Calico was gonna like, win. Yeah, I like, oh, it's over. This yeah. nigga's not ready for it. Calico was, his swag was on a thousand. He was like, yo, Look I, at him. Yes, I do this, Look I do at this. But I, I don't think it affected Lux because the second, the next two rounds with them shits was just dangerous. With a need for die, the means the green divided the rap league of tyrants and the child being defiant, I'm in battle mode. This shit preferably to show a prior professor the precise calculated correct methods of math, nigga. This how you kill, kick and kill, kill Calico. Now let Challenge show this is God's call. Younger, you got to learn how this works. Job call. It's hardball with an ball. When the shot you throw through, do cardboard like it's cardboard. I feel like I'm at your mom's door with a convoy full of armed boys from Darfur. My heart core coated in the shoulders on a U.S. soldier on long shores. But you can sense it, nigga, the tension thicker than German guard dogs. My beloved Iron Sheet say, Allah walk, bar. Oh, I'm in battle mode. This shit preferably showed the pride professor the precise calculated correct method of math, nigga. This how you kill, you can kill, kill Calico. Challenge show, this is God's call, youngin. Challenge show, this is God's call, youngin. You gotta learn how this works, job call. It's hard ball with an odd ball when the shots you throw through do card doors like it's cardboard. Are you fucking let me slow it down, put it in subtitles, something. I got you. We used to be, it used to be Chopper 2 Street, 2 2 Pox with a fleet. Oh, I'm humbled. You know, I've learned the science of rockets as my thought process at meet. You're a hobby at peak. I'm like the League Doctor's Doctrine. You're adopted, incompetent, weak. I'm about to pull every compliment out of confident weak. I can see you bopping the beat, boxing repeat. Yo, this fuck nigga Lux nigga not my lead. He got to be seen. What would you mean? Calico's soul was gone mid second round like his soul was like it was leaving you could you you know what i mean you could see you know because lux caught the spark it's two different levels of lyricism you got somebody who is straight to the point giving you punch lines giving you metaphors giving you real rap and then you got a nigga who is giving you double entendres similes reverse punch lines slow yeah. it downs he's 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 uh, multis He's giving you Easter eggs where you gotta break down yeah. stuff inside of it. He's shadow boxing like this. It's just two different levels of lyricism. Nothing, nothing Calico said can compare to that. You know what I'm saying? Even his best lines can't compare to something like that. It just can't. It just can't. It's no, it's no depth to what Calico is saying. Like his setups don't even don't even match with his filler doesn't even match. When he's the, the punchline gets to Craig list list Craig that then backhand no it doesn't work it doesn't work compared to what Lux is spinning to you, you sh Calico 
I'm sorry, I'm sorry, fans of Calico. This is gonna get very disrespectful. You should never call that motherfucker out. Why did you call him out? What was the point of calling Loaded Lux out? He didn't win a battle. He said the math didn't add up. Now he's showing you that the math did not add up. His mind flowing, I'm stopping traffic, I said. Two dome shots to put a roadblock in his head. And I ain't even gotta shoot at your man, I could put the loot on your man. I could retire, I found youngsters that'll shoot for a grand. So if you don't get your mind right, they push your brains left. I get him with smack giving me, and I got change left. Then I hit the club with only niggas that been with me and blow the rest of it at Jersey Girls in Sin City. Y'all gonna do me like this? Y'all loved me last year. Ain't no bias, my nigga. They was loving you last year. They was born math last year. You know what I mean? Niggas feel they on top of the world. And then niggas run into a brick wall. And then they, they get brought back down and, you know, brought back to reality. And I think that's just really basically what happened. First of all, at the event, I was at the event. He choked. Uh, they cut his choke out. You know, after he cried, you know, oh, uh, y'all love me last year. He choked. They cut it out. It's only one time I'm gonna ask for respect, and I'm blasting the tape. You know, and his round was short. You know, cause he choked. Last round, you're the nuts. I want y'all to picture this you. as I paint the slide. Tombstone, grain and scribe. Here lies my beloved. Grave this why? I mean, I had that much love for you. I know that because you got that much hate for I. Don't want you to hang your eye. Not for a second, little nigga. Catch it. Brace your vibe. Be froze for death is cold. I want to search your soul and hold on to whatever holes exposing the pain you hide. Bring me mine, nigga. Ah. Now, I, look, I don't want to break this bond. I just want to break the cycle. Thank your moms. I liked you. For nights she didn't write you, she stayed in line so your days could shine. I might do one better. With a letter to tell her how I appreciate God, how strong a queen she is. And any man to be lucky for her to be made his bride, you see I take in mind your situation. And though I never met your father, I see a lot of his ways in your stride. I mean, you got that talking like that walking kind of attitude. You know, it's real good that he gave you pride. Every son should be proud of his father. And I look at my little one, and I want the same for mine. That's why when I look up at you, I see what he can go through when a father don't take the time. You know, I think it's real fucked up. Hold up. Hold up. He gonna get this work. I see what he can go through when a father don't take this time. You know, I think it's real fucked up when people gave him all that time. But you want to know what's even more fucked up? It's for all the years he got away from you, has only made a way for you to be more together with him in a cage in fire. That's why I'm angry, God. Because he didn't take the steps. Now you chase his rep, but the money shoes ain't your size. They say don't whine over spilled milk. But, but what a man supposed to do when his baby's crying? Oh, he say shit like, you know, cost to be the boss. But he too good for a paying job? What was wrong with being a cable guy? A real estate agent? Why was that nigga too cool to go to flight school and learn how to fly planes through the friendly skies? But nah, he told you he had to do what he had to do to put food on y'all plate to dine. You mean to tell me all that slanging and banging was to give y'all greater lives when God gave them drive? And that big meat's back up singing ass nigga left your moms out here alone for the latest ride? That don't break your mind? Hold on, you gon' get this work. You gon' get this work, nigga. I killed you. Hold up, you gon' get this work. That don't play your, hold up. Hold up, hold up. You niggas gon' get this work, you hear me? Me. He ain't even get the second verse, but he gon' get this work. That don't play your mind? The mistakes ain't God's? And you wonder why them shotgun shook shells still ache your spine? Look what Ray Ray got little Jimmy out here in New York doing. Tell your OG Bobby Johnson he's tried to steal the wrong radio this time, nigga. Hey, if you see South Central, when you see this again, that's gonna be one of your favorite lines. Something to think about the next time you on stage waving signs, try to be like the only daddy you got. I understand you want to keep his name alive, but youngin, I'm trying to save you from your demise. You said it yourself. My pops was a real nigga. 
young and that ain't no lie. He was in the business that the system perpetuates from the side to keep us in the condition where we ain't made to survive. What you think, he a God? Well, let me ask you this. Would you kill a world and save yourself, nigga? Y'all yeah, ain't think that was wise. Something to think about the next time y'all thugging, drinking and drugging, hard liquor, y'all full of killers. Remember, hold up, I tried to give you the large picture. Hold up, man. He gonna get this work. He gonna get this work. to give him the large picture. Yo, Pops wasn't no gangster. He was just another lost nigga. You think it's gangster to let a mother let that dope murder her daughter, shoot a father from his son, and turn around and put that boy on the corner, or leave your son out here alone to fend for himself, knowing he need order? Is your money being long worth your lifespan being shorter, huh? But I'm just trying to give you the large picture. Hold up, man. Let me work. You gonna get this work, nigga. Watch me work. Lux's third round was like some demonstrate that was demonstrated that we never seen in battle rap before. But I never seen nothing like that from the way he pre meditated the whole thing and the way he carried out the whole battle, I wrote, I just witnessed the greatest performance in battle rap history. Yeah. And I had to give it up like that, you know what I'm saying?